What's up guys, welcome to your ninth PHP tutorial. In this tutorial I'm gonna be talking to you guys about the last loop. I promise it's the last one. It's called the for loop. Now what this allows you to do is execute a certain condition as many times as you want. And it's easier just to see, so let me just go ahead and explain to you guys what I'm doing. The first syntax you need is called the for. And then in your parentheses you have three what they're called parameters in the first one you initialize the variable so let's just have number we'll set it equal to num and we'll set it equal to one this is what you set your variable equal to in the first one next add a semicolon and then you set what is called a condition for your variable so we're going to say when variable num is less than or equal to 5. And of course add your semicolon. And then the last parameter is what you want it to increment by. So we're going to say take the number, our variable, and increment it by 1 every time. So now we have a variable equal to 1 and we say every time it's less than or equal to 5 add 1 so this means whatever process we're going to type next it's going to go through it 5 times so let's go ahead and type a process in use your curly braces and the process we want it to do is echo the statement hello world and then we're just going to add a line break so it actually goes on to the next line it's just easier to read so now we said for this variable that you're going to execute five times we want you each time to echo hello world so let's save this take a look at what it looks like as you can see it executed hello world five times and you can change this by changing any of these parameters right here. And that's how you get a certain condition to execute a certain number of times using PHP. Thanks.